All right, two for one tonight, so we gotta Ooh. move quickly. All right, so I, I don't know if you guys saw this over the weekend that uh, a flight from New York to London broke the subsonic record. So we're not That's talking cool. Concorde because we don't fly those anymore. Mm -hmm. There were supersonic planes. Uh, they did it in four hours and 56 minutes, and wow. this was because there was a juiced up jet stream. There were actually some wind problems in the UK uh, over the weekend uh, with damaging winds, but they rode that jet stream. Hmm. Uh, so they, they uh, clocked in about 800 miles an hour at one point. Now, quick note on this, even though that was traveling faster than the speed of sound, it was not supersonic because they were being pushed by the air around it. So relative to the air around it, it, it wasn't supersonic. It did not create a, a sonic boom. Got it. If that makes sense to everybody. But Got here's it. all the planes that were riding the jet stream. When I used to do aviation forecasting, we did that because guess what? It saves gas. Sure. It's not about Absolutely. speed necessarily, but it saves a lot of gas. It's problematic can... at the landing, though. Yeah, well, you have to <laughs> slow down and hope it's not a crosswind. Yeah. All right, next one is a, a homework assignment. Okay, oh, you got oh, two days to complete no. it. This is for viewers, too. So, this, I listened to this podcast over the weekend. It's called The Birth of Climate Denial, and it's part of a series by NPR called The United States of Anxiety. So, you can get it free. Just Google United States of Anxiety the birth of climate denial. And I'd like you to email your thoughts on this because this was really interesting. And what it goes through is something that we've talked about before is how did this become, in America's mind, a partisan political issue? Right. And I never knew the entirety of that. I knew little pieces, little snippets of, of what it is. So email me your thoughts. If your thoughts are, I'm partisan and political, I don't want to hear them. <laughs> what I want to hear is, what do you think of the evolution of this whole thing? and what you learned in, in this, because I learned a lot as well. So Very this means you two have two days, because right. you can't come in here not knowing. Oh, but you know what? I'm not going to be in on Wednesday. Uh, I'll call on. you at home.